Everybody on the list getting blankets. Everybody. Good morning. It is Tuesday. I'm getting ready to shoot a sponsored video with a videographer named Vanessa. So I got this dress from Mad Rag. So the product that I'm um, promoing today is called Bardison and it's a promo for TikTok. Um, so pretty much it's like a Keurig but for liquor or for alcoholic beverages rather. Okay y'all just got to the clubhouse. Currently unboxing all this. Say hi Vanessa. It's good. <laughs> He's my videographer for today and he also did the swaggy tags video too. So check them out. <laughs> Do you have a sharp object? A sharp object? Like a pocket knife or something? In my car, definitely. <laughs> I think I'm crazy. Hey, I've been craving. If I put it quite plainly. Barson offers a variety of cocktail mix, mix, yeah. offers of variety of cocktail mix, mixes. Blech. Barson offers a variety of cocktail mi mixes. Why, why can't I say mixes? Barson offers a variety of cocktail mixes from old fashions to margaritas, lemon drops, Long Islands, and my favorite, rum breeze. All you have to do is insert your pod, choose your strength, and Barson does the rest for you. No need for bartending experience here. No need to leave a tip. Just trying to think little quirk, quirky things to say. Barson is truly the life of the party. What else? There's really not much. Okay, I'm gonna say what kind of liquor I use, just in case. My my whiskey of choice was Crown Royal, Tito's for vodka, Malibu for rum, and Casamigos for tequila. That's really it. This is like a, such a simple machine. Going to the beach. How many takes does it take? Cause we can't do it right the first time. <laughs> <laughs>
Okay. Hey guys, so today is uh, Thursday. So it's Thursday at 7.40 p.m. and this camera has 17% left on it. That was like a perfect fit. So I just got my trays from Bites. I'm so excited. So I got Bites at night. Oh my gosh, the lighting is so bad. Hold on. Why is the lighting so bad? I don't understand why the lighting is so bad. I chose the night aligners because... Okay, let me just show you guys my teeth. Here's my smile. So, for those of you guys who've been around for like a really long time, you know I had braces... Um, like a few years ago, I never wore my retainers. So yeah, but my bite aligners came in and I'm opening it and this is how it looks. I'm so excited. There's a little pamphlet. Let's see. Okay, so you're supposed to swipe, swap out your aligners every week. And I'm supposed to use my, I'm supposed to use my hyper bite every day. Oh my gosh. Here are all of my trays. Oh, and it has my name on it. This is step one. I'm so excited. Oh my gosh. And then what is in here? So this is the hyperbite. So this is supposed to, like, you're supposed to put it in your mouth and it's supposed to, like, vibrate. Like, it has this, it's, it's supposed to, like, vibrate. I don't know. It does something. And it helps your teeth to move more quickly or something like that. I don't know. There's a little file in here. Wonder what that is for, but it comes with like this case to put your aligners, I'm assuming. I'm so excited and I just can't hide it. I'm all the and I think I can. Okay, it also has a teeth whitener in here. But if you guys are interested in trying Bite, um, I'm gonna put a link down below. And with that link, you get a percentage off when you request for your impressions. I'm so sorry that the lighting is so terrible, but I'm going to be trying this for the first time tonight. And I will update you guys tomorrow on how my mouth feels, like how my teeth feel. Good morning. I am getting ready for a shoot today. I'm actually going to be featured in a magazine. Well, I hope so. Um, I mean, they reached out to me and they asked for photos and for me to complete um, a few questions. So I'm actually going to go take those pictures now. Um, I'm actually taking this picture, these pictures because I need headshots, like I need updated headshots. Um, but when this opportunity came, I was like, why not? Like, why not do it like now? Because um, I honestly was putting it off for a while. So whether I end up in the magazine or not, hold on. There's like something on the lens. So whether I end up in the magazine or not, the pictures won't be for no reason, but this is what I have on. I'm sure you guys can tell by now that I freaking love this blazer. I'm actually gonna buy like every color. I just love the fit. Like I hate blazers who like when you turn to the side, you don't see your shape. Like I can still see my shape with this blazer. You know what I mean? And like regardless whether it's, you know, like this or not, what do you call it? Is this called like, a cons is this considered a tailored blazer? I don't know, but I'm so into the freaking blazer vibes this fall, so into it. And then I have on this black mini tube dress that I got from Pretty Little Things. By the way, this blazer is from Pretty Little Things as well. And then these shoes that I got from AliExpress. I actually did a whole haul in my last vlog, including these shoes and, I'm going to be carrying this bag. Love it! When you pulling up and... I didn't want to make a U-turn, there's a light there! I'm done. I'm done. <laughs> she a runner, she a track star. She gonna run away when it gets hot. Okay, so I'm at Lance's house right now, and look at this horse. This is not a dog, this is a horse! Look at it compared to, okay, this is a regular sized dog. Look at that! What the fuck? He's a puppy. He's not at his full size yet. Ah, oh, hell no! <laughs> He's such a puppy. 
Wow, I really should have drove. I didn't know it was this one. We right by my house. I was telling you that, but no. Josh, I thought it was the opposite it. direction. Josh, don't be knowing. But I still feel like driving on this one. Real last bitch. I love driving. We, we compliment each other very well. <laughs> Lancey Poo is driving. I call him Lancey Poo. And then Josie, living her best life right here. Hi, y'all. <laughs> so we are at Chili's. Hey, y'all. With these strangers. <laughs> I'm going shade. Chicken tender. I'm like, this came and sat on our table. From two to four. The shade. Too. I was like, what? Girl, I was like, oh. That reminded me of the time oh, Kevin, girl, like, when he tried, like, I guess one of his friends, like, showed him a video. He was like, yo, look at this girl. She's so funny. And then he was like, oh, I know her. He was like, I know her. I can he was like, her right no, now. that's my wife's old roommate. Like, and then yes. um, he was like, I'm going to text her right now. And then, no, he actually messaged me on a freaking IG. He should have texted me to make it look more legit. And he life, messaged like, me on IG and he was like, my friend just showed me this video and I told him I know you. Prove it. And I was like, I have no idea who this is. <laughs> and then he was like, I fucking hate you. <laughs> like, what did she pull? She pulled the, uh, what's her name? The Aquila and the B? She pulled the, I don't know this man. Oh, I don't yeah. know this young man. <laughs> Y'all, Chili's has the best grilled cheese. Uh, Challenge. <laughs> she, she ghetto child. She, she got ketchup with the grilled cheese. Comment down below if you dip your grilled cheese in ketchup. Restaurant, so I'm not trying to get ratchet, but that's a pedestrian. You guys sit over there. You sit over there and there we go. They're not picking me off the group table. because. <laughs> but you can't sit with us. <laughs> Damn, it's like that. Chili's molten cake, so good. Can we do like a little. Okay, fine. Okay. okay. We have to rehearse. Okay. <laughs> Alright, five, six, seven, eight. Okay. Only two. Only two. Okay. Two. Okay. And then go clockwise. Yes. Okay. One. This is clockwise. Yes. Here we go. Okay. Two. One, two. Yes. One, two, click. Okay. Five, six, seven, eight. Aww. That was so cute. I'm not going to lie. We need to do it again. That was the practice one. Okay. One, two, three. Hey guys, <laughs> oh my gosh, so it's like Tuesday, but no, I'm so sorry guys, like, I don't know what happened, I know what happened, I got super busy, guys, I got this Brito, um, water bottle filter, it's so lit, so I'm the kind of person, like, I'll drink filtered water, like, out of a Brita filter or a pure filter, and, uh, honestly, like, just all of the bottled water. It was just too much. It was just too much. Like, oh, save the planet. Save the mother loving planet. So I just decided to get a bottle water or a water bottle. Um, and this like filters the water through the straw. So it's pretty lit or whatever. My lip fillers are like completely dissolving as you can see. So I have to go back to get more because I love the way I look with lip filler. I bought this oil control on the go thing by Revlon. I got it from Target. I sprayed the Ariana Grande God is a Woman perfume and honestly like a lot of the reviews on it weren't that good. Like a lot of people said they didn't like it and when I sprayed it I absolutely loved it. I love it so much. I think I'm gonna go back and buy it because I actually genuinely really do like it. But okay so I pulled it out of the packaging and this is how it looks. Okay, I have you guys in closer. You see all this oil all over my face. Ugh. Okay, so all you gotta do is just roll it over your face. So let's see. What? Hold on.
And there's like no makeup on here. But the oil is gone. Can you guys tell? What? Okay, here's some makeup. Y'all see this forehead? Let's do half. And I'll go over my brows. That's crazy. That is crazy. What? I'm confused. I don't know. I feel like this has some kind of powder in it. Does it? I don't know when I roll it on my arm, it's dry. I don't know, but I like it. Hey guys. I haven't vlogged in like two weeks. <laughs> Today is Friday and it's 8.30 p.m. I got some packages, so let's open this together. A little change of scenery. I need to add like LED lights around my house because my house is a little dark. No clue where it's from. Oh, okay. I should be opening this on freaking TikTok, but it's okay. Okay, so we got a little Chanel. Isn't it so cute? So it has like iridescence and stuff. I honestly wish it was a solid color, but hmm, that's not the case. But I think it's so cute, don't you? So pretty much, um, I'm gonna leave this site for this down below or like the, in their Instagram, but their page is private. Um, so don't worry about that, but it looks so good. Oh. I've always wanted a Chanel. I mean, it's not, you know, whatever. <laughs> And this is like the most perfect size. Okay, but I'm gonna link their Instagram down below. They sell like super cheap um, replica bags. So this is from AliExpress. This was supposed to be included in my last haul. If you guys haven't seen it, I will link it right here. But this was supposed to be included in my last haul, but it took the longest to come. This took almost a month to get here. Um, but, Um, I ordered this gold bag. I'm confused because this is just a strap. Like, it don't got no hardware on it. Well, am I supposed to just tie it in the bag? Ugh. So, I had to do it ghetto. I had to tie it like this. It, it doesn't have any hardware on it. You see? <clears throat> but whatever. So... This is the bag, and I bought, I actually bought this to go with the freaking gold slippers that I bought, but as you guys saw in my last haul, those gold slippers were way too small. This is from this company called Out of Bounds, and they make like games, but they add black culture to like their games. Okay, so a game of culture, fun, and testing your limits. <coughs> the objective of the game is for a player to have their teammate guess the keyword in the middle of the card without using any of the out of bound words on the card itself. So, this is an example. So you have to give them clues so they can say the this word right here, but they can't say any of these. You can't say any of these words out here because then it gives like, you know. So it's pretty much like taboo, right? Yeah, very similar to taboo, but black culture. Um, and they sent this game to me and they actually sent this game to me for a reason that I can't say, but I cannot wait. Like when I tell you, just know that I'm honored. Just know. 
but there's that and then this is from skin champagne so i have to do a sponsored video for skin champagne her name is kathy she's the ceo of skin champagne she's like the first person to ever like honestly give me an opportunity <laughs> so um like she flew me out to la to be in like her um campaign um and that was like just my first time getting a taste of just that that world and it just made me work so much more harder so i could do that all the time it was so fun like i had the time of my life in la oh i don't this smells good hold on kathy why hold on okay this smells you could like smell it from too dark for me but she sent me two glow things she sent me two um and then she sent me room sprays so this is what we are wow okay so she sent me two room sprays i don't want to open these because This one is called Sugar Daddy, and this one's called Diamond. Wow, this smells so good. So these are room sprays, and they're, like, so fancy. Like, look at the packaging. Just look at the packaging. You can literally smell this through the damn the box. Like, that's how strong it is. And these are room sprays. These are perfumes this okay so this one is called intoxicant and this one has like a warm like thing going on i should probably look on our website to like find the notes but i'll put it right here and it's vegan it's vegan um she's in las vegas but it's um slow burn fragrance house is the name of this line and this one has more so of a warm, vanilla-y, like, somebody who smells like this, she's super warm, she's super inviting, she's that bitch, she got her shit together, she's just like, the epitome of black excellence, like, she's just like, she's the epitome of feminism, like, mm, that's what intoxicants is. There's one called Devious. Mm, oh my gosh okay so devious smells like um almond so this smells like almonds so if you love the smell of almonds this mm, this girl she's like this girl's very artsy she loves creating she's probably real she can probably kill a canva edit she's good at photoshop she's just so artsy and she's just so like vibey and like her voice is just so like oh, you could just listen to her talk all day or a day because her voice is just so smooth and she just carries herself with such poise and class mm, that was devious next one is glamour hold on i'm trying to smell my arm make sure i'm not okay let's spray right here oh my arms are hairy mm. So Glamour, she's a little lighter than Devious and Intoxicant, but, but she's more so on the sweeter side. She's such a sweet girl. She's super fun. She's super flirty. She's very outgoing. When she walks in the room, you just like feel her presence, her aura. She's just that bitch. And that is Glamorous. Out of all of these, my favorite is glamorous devious and then intoxicant room sprays i'm not gonna open them now because i have to do them for a video and i want them to look super fresh 
for the videos, but I will open these body shimmers. I live for a nice, this is an oil base. And look how it has my arm shining. Like look, so I don't mind this, this is like, freaking love that. And then there's this one, this one is in the darker shade. So this one is for somebody who is super chocolate. Cause I can see that this is tinting my skin a little. So, there's the darker one. Sorry, I'm trying to get to So there's the darker one. I can't tell if it tinted my skin or not, but regardless, I freaking love. I hate those like body oils that have like little shimmers in it. And I think they called it mica powders, but I hate when they're like so gold or silvery and you're just out there looking like a dang disco ball i like this because this is so subtle so it gives you that like nice little glow without you know without looking like a damn disco ball but i love it these are how the room sprays look when i tell you guys when i went to the mailbox i freaking i sm i like the mailbox it, it was the smell was so potent and I was like, oh, damn it, something spilled. Because I remember Kathy telling me that she was going to send me some room fragrances. And I was like, oh, no, it spilled. You guys, I opened the box and it was com it's completely dry. But I can still smell, I can smell it through their boxes. Like, I, oh, I already know Sugar Daddy's going to be my favorite. And, oh, Diamond just smells so clean. It's like a clean... Perfume. Oh. I love this. Anything that I can do to make my life just a little bit luxurious, like this is something as simple as a room spray, but anything anything you can do to just make it make your experience in life just a little bit more luxurious, go for it. So oh, I'm gonna link this down below. Hey guys, so today is Wednesday, October 27th. It's Wednesday. I know I didn't vlog yesterday or the day before that, but today I'm with Jazzy. Say hi. Hey y'all. <laughs> and we're going to be making blankets today. So I don't know if you guys have ever seen like the hand knitting. We're going to be like hand knitting blankets, but the like the chunky blankets that are like a freaking hundred dollars on. Okay, hold on. <laughs> Whew. Hold on. Let me collect myself. <laughs> chunky blankets that cost a freaking hundred dollars on fucking amazon yeah no so i bought these like big ass yarn are these yarns chunky yarn oh they're called chunky yarn like that's the name so chunky yarn from walmart and they were cheap they're like what six bucks each and i got four and um jazzy got these colors so pretty y'all so cute it's like a pinky nude and i got well it's a white you know but yeah we're gonna be doing this and i'm gonna do it on camera and I'll, i might do a little tutorial or maybe not i'll do a tutorial next time because i think i'm gonna make more around christmas everybody get a blanket you get a blanket you get a blanket you get a blanket. <laughs> i might include that in like everyone's gift or something but yeah take an ice cream break it's had my hair on bike but this is where we are so far um it's not consistent at all 
like I started to get looser here and then I got my life together here so hopefully it all works out at the end but I'm for sure not gonna have enough yarn like this is gonna be the size of like a large scarf because I only have two left and yeah but it's so cute Okay guys, so, okay, I'm not done with the blanket, but I ran out of yarn. And we literally went, we did a Walmart run and got more yarn and it still wasn't enough. Well, I got more yarn, unfortunately. Y'all, they did not have my color. <laughs> Jazzy's yarn was out of stock, but Trouble. this is what I have so far. <sighs> you know, I like it. I wish I did it tighter, but it's okay, because I know what to do next time. But this is how it looks folded over. I feel like I like this side better than this side, if that makes sense. But yeah, she's so cute. cute. I and know. It's soft. So soft. And I'm gonna go back to Walmart tomorrow. And I'm gonna get more yarn. But oh my gosh, I look so greasy. Maybe you don't know what you do to me. Between me and you, I feel a chemistry. I won't let no one come and take your place. Turn me inside out, out, make my heart beat. Leave no one else. You're all I need. Personality, and everything you do. It's me, love, and everything about you. Hey guys, so this isn't even a weekly vlog anymore. This is like, started off as a week and spilled over to like a month. So unfortunately, my grandmother did pass away. Um, that's why I've kind of been like off the radar a little bit. Um, I've just been like 
posting like even on tiktok i've just been posting mostly brand deals i haven't really been posting a lot of comedy content or anything um but my grandmother was very very sick and she was put on hospice and we were just trying to be with her and make her comfortable and make her as comfortable as she could be um for her last few days and unfortunately she passed on october 30th um the only thing that's keeping me sane right now is knowing that she's no longer in pain because she was in so much pain but now she's not so that's the only thing that's giving me some peace of mind i don't want to make this a super sad you know vlog so <clears throat> i wanted to show you guys the blanket that i made because i did um start it off on this vlog so i wanted to show you guys the finished product So here is the blanket. I freaking love it. It is so warm. Ooh. So for this blanket, I ended up needing, hold on, wait. I went back to the store and how much did I get? So for this blanket, I ended up needing nine rolls of that yarn. So to get a decent sized blanket, I would honestly recommend 10. Um, I only used nine because it's all they had. Like they ran out super quick so again i would recommend you guys get it from walmart.com where they can like deliver it to you or amazon next time around i'm gonna make it like more tighter like i'm gonna make the you know the weaving thing more tighter because um honestly like the weight kind of like loosens it up over time so like when i was like threading it or whatevering whatever i don't know um, when I was weaving it, um, I wanted I made it loose because I wanted it to be loose, but I should have made it tighter because <laughs> now I put this on my body and my toes are sticking out. But honestly, I freaking love it because like it's warm, but it also doesn't like heat me up if that makes sense because there are small holes in it. So yeah, it's like it's like the perfect medium. But I freaking love it. Like look how cozy. Like look how cozy. If you guys want me to do an in-depth tutorial on how I did this, I know like I did a super brief, you know, tutorial um, because I was just trying it out. Like I didn't really know how to do it. But if you guys want an in-depth tutorial, I will for sure do it for you guys. But I freaking love it because um, everybody getting this um, for Christmas, everybody, everybody, everybody on the list getting blankets. Everybody on the list getting blankets. Everybody on the list getting blankets. Period. Okay, my living room looks like crap right now, but just look how it looks like on the couch. It just adds texture. My house is a mess, okay? But it just adds like the nice bit of texture that, you know, the space needs, and I freaking love it. Don't mind my laundry, she gonna get done. But yeah. But I am going to end this vlog here. Don't forget to like and comment on this video and subscribe to my channel. And you guys feel free to put some suggestions down below on what videos you'd like to see from me. I'm thinking about doing like some self care videos because um, people keep asking me about my skincare routine, which I'm like, wow, my skin is not all that. <laughs> um, body care routine. Some people want some nail tutorials and oh, guys, nail tutorials. Ugh. Like it just takes so long to record. Like it already takes me so long to do my nails. Imagine recording. But I'll do it for y'all, okay? But here are my nails this week. I freaking love them. I tried a new shape. And I'm not gonna lie, this might be my shape for the next few months because I love this. It's like that trendy shape, but you guys know I have to make it long because mm -hmm. thanks for watching. Mm -hmm.